Hello everyone, NTA2K10 here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to draw 50 shades of grey. The first thing you're going to do is select the square tool here and draw a square, or as close as you can get to a square. And then you're going to select the select tool and select the square, copy it and paste it. The shortcut for that is Control C and then Control V. Then you're going to copy these two and paste paste them right next to the other two. Then you're going to select the four and paste them right next to the other four. Then you're going to take just two of them and then stick them on the end here so that in total you have ten of them. Then you're going to select the whole top row and create a bottom row. Then select this row and create a row underneath. Then we're just going to select another row this time and put it on the bottom so that we have 50. The next thing we're going to do is take the fill bucket and we're going to go to grey and fill the first one in grey. Then we're going to go to a grey below and then fill the second one in that shade of grey. And these ones I did earlier when I was doing 50 shades of grey but I think I did a hundred shades of grey when I was on my own. I don't want to show you that because some of you might get bored. But I'm going to go ahead and select these and just put them in and now, as you can see, I've run out. There are no more greys to put in. So we've gone edit colours. We'll go on, move this about a bit. Press OK. Fill in a square. Edit colours again. Move this maybe a little bit higher. Fill that in. We have another shade of grey. Might move that up. Fill that in. And we'll keep going until we have 50 shades of grey. Now you want to be careful not to do this. If you take it too high, that's not grey is it? That's white. And the video would be false in that case. I'll be showing you 49 shades of grey and a white. But what I want to do is make sure that I'm being truthful and genuinely showing you 50 shades of grey. Likewise, I don't want to go all the way down on edit colours and do black. Because once again, that would be false. So, make sure you stay consistent. Make sure you do actually choose grey. And don't do something silly like over here because that's clearly not grey. But just stay on the bottom here, which is where the shades of grey are. Pick them and fill them in in your 50 squares. And eventually you will have 50 shades of grey. Just I'm not going to go the whole way because that may get a bit boring. Well, you get the idea. So for all of you who are wanting to do Fifty Shades of Grey, you know, be able to draw it, show your friends, show your family. This is the technique that you are to do. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next video.